hello you are welcome how to solve this interesting question without using calculator so the question is 500 to the power of 500 divided by 250 to the power of 250 we have to simplify this interesting question solution the question is 500 to the power of 500 divided by 250 to the power of 250 we have to solve this interesting question so we know that this 500 is also equal to 2 times 250 2 times 250 is equal to 500 and to the power of this 500 divided by 250 to the power of 250 now to solve this interesting question we know that a times b to the whole power of m this is equal to a to the power of m times b to the power of m so to apply this condition this will become 2 to the power of 500 times 2 to the power of 500 2 to the power of 500 times 250 to the power of 500 divided by 250 to the power of 250 now in the next step 2 to the power of 500 times 250 to the power of 500 divided by 250 to the power of 250 now we know that a to the power of m divided by a to the power of n when the bases are same so this will be equal to a to the power of m minus n so we have to apply this condition on this so this will become two to the power of 500 times 250 to the power of 500 minus 250 500 minus 250 2 to the power of 500 times 250 to the power of 500 minus 250 is equal to 250 now in the next step 2 to the power of this 500 is also equal to 2 times 250 times 250 to the power of 250 2 to the power of 2 and to the whole power of 250 times 250 to the power of 250 here we apply this condition a to the power of m times n is equal to a to the power of m to the whole power of n therefore this is e equal to 2 to the power of 2 to the whole power of 250 by applying this condition 2 square is equal to 4 and to the power of 250 times 250 to the power of 250 here the power are same here 250 and this is 250 so this is in the form of a to the power of m times b to the power of m this is equal to a times b to the whole power of m so here we have to apply this condition so this will become 4 times 250 to the whole power of 250 now 4 times 250 this is equal to 1000 and to the whole power of 250 we know that 1000 is equal to 10 to the power of 3 and to the whole power of this 250 now in the next step to solve this interesting question 10 to the power of 3 times 250 3 times 250 which is equal to 10 to the power of 250 times 3 this is equal to 750 
so this is the final answer and simplified form of this interesting question which is 500 to the power of 500 and divided by 250 to the power of 250 so the answer of this question is 10 to the power of 750 thank you for watching